today's daily Bible thought stays with the theme of snow, but it's a little bit more dramatic than some of the other verses. Well, I think all of them have been dramatic because saying that our sins, though there is scarlet, could be white as snow, that's the most dramatic thing ever. But the last two days are going to be descriptions, and they're prophetic, revelatory descriptions. So these are revelations that have appeared to prophets. And so we're going to hear from Daniel today, and we'll hear from John tomorrow from Revelation. But read the book of Daniel. It's more than just lion's den. It's more than just um, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego and the fiery furnace. But of course, you may not even know that story, and that could be another daily Bible thought. This is Daniel 7, verse 9 and 10. I have to read 10 because it's like a continuation. This is Daniel, and he had this vision. I watched as thrones were put in place, and the Ancient One sat down to judge. His clothing was as white as snow, his hair like purest wool. He sat on a fiery throne with wheels of blazing fire, and a river of fire was pouring out, flowing from his presence. Millions of angels ministered to him. Many millions stood to attend him. Then the court began its session and the books were opened. So white as snow, his clothing is white as snow because he is pure. The ancient one, without sin, God Almighty. And so that is quite a vision. So read the book of Daniel. It's amazing. And like I said, it's more than a fiery furnace. It's more than it's it's a revelation. It's a prophetic word. And so don't be afraid of them. Revelation is the same way. It's not something to be afraid of. It's something to acknowledge that God revealed something to a man, inspired him to write it down so that we would have it. And it, it's to be an encouragement to us and for us to be warned about things to come. And so just remember, this is a neat an amazing description, not neat, that sounds kind of contrite, it's an awesome descri description of the Holy God.